Approaching my vehicle, I'm checking underneath to see if there's any leaks, obstructions, or if the vehicle is leaning. Uh, up top, I got five uh, marker lights, one beacon. They're all amber in color. They're properly secured, not cracked or broken. Got two highway horns that are properly secured, not cracked or broken. We got a windshield that is properly secured, not cracked or broken. No illegal stickers. We got two wiper blades that are properly secured, not cracked or broken. We got two clear headlights that are properly secured, not cracked or broken. On this side, I got two amber color lights that are properly secured, not cracked or broken. Their functions are for running, turning, flashing. We got a hood latch that is properly secured, not cracked or broken. I got two amber and color lights that are properly secured, not cracked or broken. Their functions are for running, turning, and flashing. I got another hood latch that is properly secured, not cracked or broken. I got a coolant reservoir that is properly secured, not cracked or broken. Uh, it's not leaking. Once I get to the other side, I can see if it's filled to the proper operating level at the sight glass. I got a wiper motor that's properly secured, not cracked or broken. No frayed wires. I got a washer reservoir that's properly secured, not cracked or broken, no leaking. Uh, it's filled to the proper operating level. My fuse block that's properly secured, not cracked or broken. There's no frayed wires. Got a couple of solenoids that are properly screwed, not cracked or broken. No frayed wires. I got a couple of dipsticks, a transmission dipstick and an engine oil dipstick. They're both properly screwed, not cracked or broken. They're not leaking. The transmission dipstick, uh, I got to check with the engine running on a level surface. While my engine oil dipstick, I got to check with the engine off on a level surface, check for the proper operating level. My power steering. Uh, pump that's properly screwed, not cracked or broken. Uh, no leak welds, it's gear driven, it's not leaking. My air compressor is properly screwed, not cracked or broken. No leak welds, that's gear driven, it's not leaking. Got my air intake hose that is properly screwed, not cracked or broken, it's not leaking. My coolant hose that is properly screwed, not cracked or broken, it's not leaking. Got my uh, green one inch serpentine belt that's properly screwed, not cracked or broken. No, it's not frayed and uh, it is having no more than half inch to three quarter inch of play. Uh, that runs the radiator fan that cools my radiator, which in turn is my water pump that sends coolant into the engine, which in turn is my alternator, which sends uh, supplies uh, electricity to my batteries to charge it. I got my my steering shaft and knuckle that's properly secured, not cracked or broken. No legal welds, and my knuckle should be greased. Got my power steering reservoir that's properly secured, not cracked or broken. It's not leaking, and it's filled to the proper operating level. Got my power steering hose that is properly secured, not cracked or broken. No leaking. Got my gearbox that is properly secured, not cracked or broken. Uh, it's not leaking, and this is also gear driven. Got my pitman arm and drag link that is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. No illegal welds. It's held together with castle nuts and cover keys. Right over here is a uh, shock that is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. No illegal welds, and it's not leaking. My frame is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. No illegal welds. Uh, my leaf spring is properly skewed, not cracked or broken, no legal welds. It's attached to the front of the frame with brackets, nuts, and bolts. To the rear of the frame with brackets, nuts, and bolts. To the middle of the axle with U bolts and nuts. I got my ABS wire is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. It's not frayed. My brake hose is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. It's not leaking. My brake chamber is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. And it's, there's no illegal welds. My slack adjuster is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. No illegal welds. And attached to that is a push rod and cotter keys. And note that is properly skewed, not cracked or broken. And the push rod should not be bent. And should not have no more than one inch of play. If I need to check that, I'll check it on the level of surface with the brakes disengaged and the vehicle in neutral. On my brake landings and drums, 
are properly screw nut cracked or broken. The drums have no illegal welds. The brake linings should have no less than a quarter inch of wear and should be free from dirt, grime, and grease. My rim in the inside is properly screw nut cracked or broken. No illegal welds. My faces of my tire on the out inside is having no abrasions, bulges, and cuts. My tread is no less than two, four thirty seconds of wear. My outside of my tire is free from abrasions, bulges, and cuts. My rim is properly screwed, not cracked or broken, no illegal welds. My lug nuts are properly screwed, not cracked or broken, no illegal welds. There's no rust or shiny particles, which is an indication of looseness. My self-enclosed wet hub is properly screwed, not cracked or broken. It's not leaking. If I need to check the tire, I'll check it at the valve stem, and it needs to have a cap.